Pisces, no matter how much somebody loves somebody here, and it is, it is very a lot, okay? And somebody is definitely on the verge here of walking away. Things are very obscure here for someone. Um, there's a lot of secrets, a lot of mystery, a lot of concealing that's going on. There's a lot of love here, you guys. Um, we got somebody with an open heart. We got somebody who has empathy on somebody who is very toxic. We got somebody who is vulnerable. We have somebody who is devoted, attached, and they actually crave this person. Okay. Um, they have stuck in here. Okay. Whoever this is, Pisces, if this is you, if this is you, the one that has this open heart and it's, you've been met with obscurity. Listen, somebody definitely is on the verge here of ending this, okay, of walking away, of closure, of some type of finality. They've really been thinking about this, okay? They've really, he hasn't, he hasn't got up. Okay. Hold on one second, you guys. Okay, Pisces, sorry about that. If this is you, okay, that has this open heart and receptive, um, somebody is really thinking here. They're in hermit mode, you guys. They're analyzing this behavior. They're analyzing actions that has been done. They're actually analyzing words that have been said. Somebody here, even though um, there may not be any wrongdoing per se on somebody's end, nobody's perfect, and it feels to me like maybe this is... You know, somebody's dragging somebody. That's going to be the truth for some of you guys, okay? Um, but the way they're going about dragging is, you know, third-party situations, you know, uh, hiding and, and all this other stuff. Treating somebody like they're just garbage. Um, but nonetheless, somebody definitely is soul-searching here. Somebody's doing a lot of self-reflection, introspection, a lot of analyzation, um, possibly self-care, but definitely solitude, okay? And definitely learning lessons that has been learned here. Listen, even if somebody is not the person who was the one that was in the wrong, right? Um, they still want to negotiate. They still want to negotiate this relationship because like I said, there is somebody here who is very devoted, okay? There is somebody here who is attached. They crave somebody. They're very receptive. Their heart is open to this person. They have a lot of empathy for this individual and they are vulnerable. They do not want to walk away. This is the last thing that they want to do. However, it's the energy of feeling like being pushed, okay? Because of the obscurity, the secrets, the mysteries, and the concealing, okay? It's been a lot of damage being done. Somebody has showed up. Pisces, this is King of Cups. If I was to say if you were anybody on this here board, I would definitely say this was you. I'm um, rather you a female or a dude, okay? But nonetheless, one word, all words, no words. Somebody has damn sure showed up emotion, emotionally balanced, okay? Um, mother, father figure for some of you. Passionate for some of you. Wise, caring, diplomatic, tolerant, friendly for some of you. I have seen where some of you guys have, have uh, clapped back um and devoted okay but what i see here is that somebody has treated somebody like trash here okay i see somebody feels like somebody is discarding or feels like you know somebody is a lack of importance or their feelings doesn't matter they're still going out here in this world and they're still doing the things that are not conducive to a monogamous relationship they're doing a lot of lying you guys they're doing um a lot of sneaky behavior a lot of hidden things okay i would not be surprised if i see the moon come out okay i won't be surprised if i see the seven of swords come out but um somebody here like i said as much as somebody does not want to close the door on somebody they don't want to walk away from somebody there's a railroad track somewhere around somebody's house um a train or something okay um, that's specific for some of you guys, but um, they're on the verge of calling this here shot, y'all, okay? Um, and if they're not on the verge of calling this here shot, they're on the verge of telling somebody the direct ass honest truth, okay? Because they're getting fed up. They've had so much patience, okay? So much empathy here that it's almost like they don't want to rock the boat, okay? And really, to be honest with you, for a lot of you, the truth is going to be that there is no boat, okay? It's an illusion. It's a, it's a fantasy that there's a boat here to even be rocked, okay? Because like I said, there is somebody here that has literally thrown somebody out like trash, okay? So that will be the truth for some of you. Somebody is trying to save a sinking ship, okay? That's going to be the truth for some of you. For others of you, you know, maybe there is some type of salvation here, even though I don't see it right now. 
Um, I see where somebody definitely has tried. I see this here new relationship. I see the baby mom, baby dad. I see the love. I see the pure intentions. I see the happiness. I see the romance. I see somebody overflowing with love here and to the point to where they're not even getting poured in. But what they're doing is they're pouring out. Um, but this is also ending up in tragedy, you guys. That's what's clarifying that card, okay? It's seriously ending up in tragedy. This love has hurt somebody. Somebody possibly may have legal issues here, but there is a shot that is going to be called here. Somebody is going to be coming to an awakening, um, a legal ruling, a judgment, or some type of change of status, okay? For some of you guys, this is already over, all right? Um, for some of you guys... Um, Maybe it's been over several times and you guys have tried again and tried again, okay? For others of you guys, like I said, you're on the verge. For the ones of you guys that this is over, okay? That somebody has already called the shot, okay? Somebody definitely is hiding from somebody here. They don't want to uh, come face to face with this energy or this person. Um, this hurts a lot, okay, you guys? Um somebody realizes that they've been juggled here somebody realizes that they're not the only one somebody realizes that you know what they wanted so bad with this relationship you know um they're really it's coming to the light and they're finding out that you know in order to be with this person this person is it's not a monogamous thing it's all it, it will always be riddled with you know somebody else involved in you guys stuff okay Somebody is coming to the realization of this. And honestly, this is not something that somebody wanted. It's too much love here, okay? So I really feel like even with this negotiation card here in this hermit, somebody's thinking, analyzing. Somebody is even saying to themselves, and this will be the truth for some of you, that, you know, can I live this way? Can I be in this person's life knowing that this person has someone else or this person goes off and deals with someone else? How am I able to be able to handle that? And really actually negotiating with themselves and actually thinking that that is a, you know, a, a possible, okay? And for others of you, y'all's like, fuck no, okay? There's no fucking way. I'm not fixing to be, you know, nobody's uh, option, okay? You got, you know, that energy is here as well, okay? No matter where you are um, in this, you know what I'm saying? Bottom line is, is that somebody has awakened into the fact that they're being juggled, okay? They've been, um, you know, soul dreams here for some of you guys, wishy-washiness, um, not doing what they say they're going to do, not meaning what they say, not saying what they mean, a whole lot of wishy-washy mixed messages, um, one minute is this way. One minute is that way. You know, just, just a bunch of imbalance, you guys, and a lot of disappointment. Okay. Um, a lot of tr having to adapt to this individual. All right. Um, somebody is coming, you know, to this realization here and, you know, you know, it could be profit and loss here. It could be financial stress as well. Listen, somebody is burnt out, okay? Somebody is very hurt. Somebody is very disappointed. Um, they're frustrated. It's, it's really driving somebody crazy here because somebody has a commitment to somebody, okay? Somebody is committed to somebody here, okay? Whereas the other individual has a lot of options, okay? And not only do they have the options, Pisces, this person indulges in their options, okay? And, and for some of you, you guys, the truth will be is that this person goes out and seeks more options, okay? Because this person has to have validation from all over the damn place, okay? So it's not that somebody here isn't pouring into their person, okay? Um, what it is, is, is that it's just not enough, okay? When a cup is empty, y'all, and you just fill it up, right? And you're thinking you're doing the best, right? To, 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 to build somebody up, to be there, to show up in a relationship, all that, right? When they're empty, even that is not enough. It takes more and more and more for individuals like this, for the one that I'm talking, for the ones that I'm talking to about this individual, okay? If you're dealing with this type of individual. This person is not, they're insatiable, y'all, okay? It's an empty pit. It's, it's, it's an endless pouring into, okay? And it's not just an endless pouring into for from you. It's also an endless pouring into from other people, okay? They cannot get enough of it because they're depleted on the inside, okay? This person is lost, Pisces, all right? And I truly feel like that's the reason why empathy came out, okay? Because I truly, truly feel 
Like, and I wouldn't even be surprised if high priestess come out. Listen, I truly, truly feel like somebody knows that this person is empty. I truly, truly feel like somebody knows that this person is lost. Okay. This person may have had a bad childhood. This person may be addicted to drugs. This person may have an alcohol problem. This person may have, um, been, you know, pushed to the side all their life. You see what I'm saying? And, and somebody sees something in this person and it's almost like a coddling type of energy. You see what I'm saying? That will be the truth for some of you guys, okay? Um, but it's drastic, y'all. The, the way that this person moves is drastic, okay? It's very extreme, it's harsh, and it's very cold, okay? Cut off game is strong. When I tell you they act as if they don't give a fuck, they don't, okay? It's not that they're acting here, you guys. This really is the four of cups, okay? So when they get into this mood, all right? Of they don't want to be bothered and they don't want to deal okay listen somebody here is on the verge all right of saying goodbye but you need to understand that this person has already been in this four of cups energy they have been unhappy they've been in apathy regret pessimistic indifferent and reluctant okay and this is the reason why they're so extreme this is the reason why they're so intense their energy okay they're so cutthroat okay and at any time they can cut somebody off at any time they're, you're like, you know, you, I can see if somebody did something. I can see if you was abusing them. I can see if you was cheating on them. I don't see any of that yet. This is starting energy. OK, now, if you have done something to this person, this would make perfect sense to me. OK, um, if you have cheated on this person, if you have lied to this person, if you have sent this person up the yellow brick road. OK, if you have put your hands on this person, I can see where this dynamic would take place. Okay. The problem that I'm having here is, is that I don't see any of that. Not yet. Anyway, I don't see where anybody has really done anything to somebody except be devoted to them, except be attached to them, except being open to them and going along with, to a certain degree, their bullshit. Okay. Time is ticking. Okay. You need to understand that time is running out. All right. There's a deadline here. Okay. And what that deadline is, you guys, is um somebody falling back but let me just say this before i say that because i got judgment over here and i got four swords over here so you know it is a possibility that somebody is in jail here okay and time may be ticking in order for them to get out or vice versa okay they may be in trouble with the law okay or court or whatever in time is ticking there's a deadline to where they're going to be sitting down in jail okay that could mean that that's a side note you guys um but anyway yeah somebody is definitely on the verge okay um of solitude you guys they're tired of the anxiety they're tired of the grief okay they're tired of the stress okay they die a thousand deaths with this pain here okay they need to rest is what they need to do but at the same time they're fearful they're fearful of losing this person but at the same time they still need to recuperate because they're overwhelmed you guys somebody is going to have to retreat it's just as simple somebody is going to have to retreat and time is ticking okay so this is what i got pisces and this is what we're gonna deal with this got everything to do with somebody loving somebody here okay they are um madly in love with this person and um and this person you know possibly they reciprocate at times and then possibly they don't um you know i do see where it is over for some of you guys and for some of you guys i see the back and forth okay with the death and the ace of cups that's breaking up getting back together breaking up getting back together okay but see everything comes to an end because i got finality here okay and i got it because of the secrets i got this because of the mysteries i got this because of the obscurity and the concealing information okay somebody literally doesn't trust somebody here okay so pisces much love, much respect, you guys. Thank you so much for still being here with me, my day ones, my VIPs, you guys. I love you guys to death. Thank you for your support, you guys. For my new and recent subscribers, um, if you guys have not let me know, please go in the comment section below. Let me know that you're new. That way I can give you a warm welcome that you deserve, you guys. Train to go shout out. My train to go membership, you guys. Join Train to Go. It is about being in the know. Um, there are so many perks and pr promos going on right now. It's not going to last forever, you guys. Um, but at the same time, I'm, I'm leaving it open for a little 
little while, okay, for these promos and these perks. Um, I would love to have you guys, and um, we vibe high there. There's a lot of wonderful people there, okay? So with that being said, Pisces, I've already prayed over these clarifiers in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. I've asked for truth, revelation, confirmation, guidance, consolation, peace, and protection as I give Jesus Christ all the praise, the honor, and the glory, okay? So this is what we are expecting in this read, okay? Somebody has been spinning the wheels in their brain, okay? They have been really thinking about how they can sit here and negotiate, okay? Puzzle pieces, anytime you get a general read from me it is always puzzle pieces please do not forget that what they've been thinking about is this relationship this ten of cups okay what they've been thinking about is this overflowing love how they wanted a family with this person this marriage proposal higher connection how they wanted celebrations how they wanted gatherings you know how they wanted good times and to spend their life with this individual you guys and they're negotiating they're negotiating how they can still have this love okay knowing that this person is um they're really you know not playing along okay they're not yeah they want to win y'all this is the reason why the negotiation is here rather this be you your person or cross watcher cross watcher energy can and will get involved cross watcher i want you guys to know that i love cross watcher just like i love pisces if this is a pisces that's done this to you please go in the comment section below let me know i am very interested to know how energy interchanges and you guys will be doing me a big favor i love you guys remember like share and subscribe um, but yeah, hit the thumbs up button for me, please, Pisces. Appreciate you. But yeah, somebody wants victory, okay? Somebody definitely does. Somebody might be in the spotlight here. Awards, accolades, but nonetheless, listen, somebody wants victory in this relationship. And this is the reason why they're negotiating with themselves of what they're going to take and what they're not going to take. And this has caused a lot of mental anguish. There is somebody here that has a serious ass decision that they're going to have to make. This is the reason why finality is here and obscurity is here, okay? Because it's a lot of mental anguish here, you guys. Uh, for some of you, <coughs> this is a stalemate, okay? For some of you, this has caused a lot of insecurity, okay? This is a very difficult uh, choice. Give me not a cup. I'm um, excuse me, King of Cups. Somebody has literally, you know, treated somebody like garbage here. Listen, this relationship, it, you know, this marriage, this long-term commitment, this, you know, somebody that somebody proposed to, um, somebody who somebody married to, whatever the case may be, okay? This right here is on the line, you guys. Somebody been praying. Somebody may be possibly, somebody may be calling their pastor. Somebody may be talking to church people. Somebody may be praying with somebody here regarding this. There will be some type of communication here. Travel is here as well. Somebody is very hasty when it comes down to this relationship. They can't stop thinking about the um the exciting times too. There's messages here, but there's rapid changes. Listen, the magician just showed up, you guys. Um, listen, you guys, for some of you, the truth is going to be that you guys have prayed together. The truth will be that you guys have been to church together. Okay. But the truth will also be that this person is a skilled manipulator and this person is a skilled liar. Okay. So while they're sitting up here, you know, not saying that, you know, everybody, cause we ain't none of us perfect. I don't care how much you read the Bible. Okay. You still ain't perfect. But at the same time, they know that they're doing wrong. Okay. For, for those of you that that applies. Okay. Um, give me, um, this judgment. Like I said, somebody could be in court, jail, something to that degree. Okay. Somebody may be at a distance. Somebody may be going off to jail at a distance. Okay. Some legal problems may have happened at a distance. Some disruption may have happened at a distance. Something at a distance could be online. Somebody may not be originally from where they're at right now. Um, this is rehab. This is, um, rehabilitation, jail, ankle monitor, halfway house, parole, probation, whatever case may be. Okay. This has been a problem. Okay. I, I mean, with the six of swords, I'm going to see the tower. Okay. It's one way or another. All right. There, there's been a sudden change. There's been some type of shocking event. Okay. Somebody definitely does see somebody as a bright opportunity. Somebody definitely is looking for some money here. Either you cross watch or third party, um, or they met somebody and see somebody as a great opportunity. Okay. A bright opportunity or a solid prospect. Yeah. Seeing somebody's crying. I don't know if this is you Pisces that's crying real tears, you know, or your person. Okay. That's crying real tears. You guys. Somebody's crying real tears though. Okay. Somebody's focused on loss here. Those of you for you that, you know, somebody definitely needs to go into peace, harmony and flow because there's been too much conflict. Okay. There's been too much up and down. There's been too much confusion, too much frustration. Okay. 
um, like I said, somebody definitely does need to recuperate. Um, but there's been a lot of opposition, okay? Ego clashing, competition. Um, this could be domestic violence as well, okay? There is other people here involved in this. Give me death, please. The death card. Stability. Somebody's spying. Somebody found out something. Somebody is watching somebody here when it comes to this ending. Okay, there's gossip. There's a lot of curious curiosity, a lot of mental agility when it comes down. Somebody's hiding. Somebody's hiding and looking at somebody's money and or stability. Okay, somebody might be. Didn't I tell you I thought I was going to see the, the yes, seven of swords? There we go. Okay, somebody's watching somebody be a liar, stealer, killer, cheater, thief, fake, phony, lack of conscience, manipulative, strategic, risky as hell, sneaky. Some of y'all done got theft. Some of y'all got thievery. Right. And see what they doing is, is they sitting up here forging bonds with other people. Okay. And they're lying to other people as well, but they are admiring somebody else here. So this could be after it ended, or this could be the reason why it ended. Okay. Whoever this person is definitely does have some money. Um, definitely does look at wishes granted. Either they look at your person as being wishes granted, or your person looks at them as, or you look at somebody as being wishes granted, like success attainment. Okay, thinking that this is going to be a happy relationship. All right. Somebody definitely is going into the dreams come true. Somebody might be in school here. Starting a business. Somebody's coming up sexy, crazy, cool. Okay. This person got a lot of swag about themselves. Okay, they, they cap a lot too, though, but they do got a lot of swag about themselves. Okay, somebody is very attractive, highly attracted to this individual. Person is highly sexual. There's tragedy here, you guys. What is she doing? Somebody wants a new start. Somebody wants to start over with this person, a new beginning, and somebody doesn't. Okay, somebody is in terror. All right, somebody cannot sleep. They're full of worryation regarding this. They're trying to figure out what form, what bonds are being forged with other people. They're trying to see where they're starting up new beginnings with other people. They want some mental clarity when it comes down to other people in this relationship here because they can't sleep at night, y'all. They're full of burden, remorse, regret, guilt. One of them, disappointment, even having nightmares for some of you guys, okay? This is bothering the hell out of somebody, right? And this is an ex situation or on the verge of being an ex situation. This is somebody that somebody has a serious bond with. Listen, somebody's suffering from depression dealing with this person. Somebody might have started doing drugs or, alcohol, or abusing alcohol, um, you know, or toxic ways, you know, because of this depression here. All right. Definitely can't sleep at night, but they're realizing that they've been juggled. OK, they realize that there's somebody else in this picture. And maybe they realize that several somebody else's is in this picture. This is very toxic cap. I mean, excuse me. Um, you might be dealing with a Capricorn, but this is very uh, toxic uh, Pisces. Okay. Cause the devil is here. All right. This is restrictions, temptations. They switch up too much. Okay. And they sell dreams. One minute they feel, make it seem like, you know, it's fate for y'all to be together and, you know, money is coming and everything is going to be all good. And then, you know, hey, we, we, we're right back here to this page of cups energy, to this seven of swords energy. Let me see something. What did I say I want to break down? It was something I said I wanted to break down real quick. Let's see something here. Hold on a second, you guys. I'm trying to see something because I did say I want to break something down here. Let me see. Seven. Yeah, this person is definitely a liar, stealer, killer, cheater, thief, fake, phony, okay? This person definitely has a lack of conscience. This person plays a lot of games. They're very sneaky, okay? Very. This is a life lesson for somebody here. Somebody threw up a concrete wall. Somebody might throw up a concrete wall. This person is in authority. They're very authoritative. They're, you know, they're in their power, you guys. And they got a lot of shit to hide. All right. A lot. Illusion, secrets, deception, misconception. Something very imbalanced, something very um, injustice. Or like I said, they're hiding some type of legal law situation or they may be hiding a record. OK, that could be it, too. OK. 
they might not be telling somebody. Somebody's definitely finding out some information. Somebody definitely told somebody direct ass sign is truth. Because somebody's in a relationship here. Somebody found out about a relationship. Somebody's finding out more about a relationship. Or somebody is finding out what this person has been doing in this relationship. Okay? The travel that they've been doing. The romantic. The romancing outside. Okay? Give me the seven of cups. Because somebody is very, you know, they're depressed about this. Okay? Because they're seriously committed to this person. And somebody definitely does have a whole lot of opportunities. Listen, these are bullshit opportunities, Pisces. But nonetheless, they are, okay? They're, they're options. Okay, this person works. Somebody wants to get their money up, seriously. Somebody's family is involved in this, okay? And when I say family, I mean mother, you know, dad, brother, sister, cousin. Somebody's family, you know, maybe this is an intervention, okay? It could possibly be that. That's going to be the truth for some of y'all. Nonetheless, somebody comes from money for some of you guys. Somebody's very weak here, okay? Somebody is extremely weak when it comes down to these options, these multiple possibilities, and these choices, okay? They 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 have a very hard time saying no, okay? Um, somebody's in the four cups, all right? I really don't think that their behavior. I really don't think they think much about their behavior, okay? Or if they do, they make excuses for it, okay? And I really don't even think they go too far into making the... Did they not tell you I thought I was going to see High Priestess? Listen, somebody knows this, okay? Somebody knows that they're not showing up the way that they should. Somebody knows that they deserve better here, okay? And that somebody is not coming to the table with what, you know, somebody should be coming to the table with. They know that it, they're starting to realize that something is unattainable. Puzzle pieces, remember that, okay? Somebody's at a fork in the road if they want to deal with this person. I told you. Obscurity. I told you. Farewell. I told you somebody's thinking about leaving something behind. They're at a fork in a road. Okay. They are seriously thinking. They are seriously weighing their options. They are seriously waiting on more information for some of you to make decisions to leave comfort zone. Okay. Because somebody, as much as somebody loves, yeah, see, two of cups, proposal, love, marriage, soulmates compatibility balance somebody's at a fork in the road because it's not okay they want it to be they will give anything with this star all right they will give anything to have this okay because they're saying it's only you devoted attached but it's almost like they can't because they're being forced to fall back because they're being met with defensiveness they're being met with protectiveness they're being somebody's not vulnerable to them okay somebody is 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 resistant to them this could be domestic violence as well, okay? But somebody is literally standing their ground, okay? Maybe somebody be a militant. It is, does say harsh here. They want to do what they want to do. And what they want to do is be not a wands, okay? Whether it's a female or a dude, okay? That's what they want to do, okay? They want to be adventurous. They want to be in and out. They want to take a risk. They want to flirt. They want to charm people. They want to be flirtatious. They are rebellious. They are intense. They are inconsistent. They speak a good game. Uh, they talk about investing. They talk about romances. I see the fancy restaurants, the nice shit overlooking the city. I see that shit, okay? Um, but I see the third-party situations. And I also see somebody damn discombobulated and blinded to the truth, okay? This person is very possessive. But cut off is here, okay? Somebody is about to get cut off. That's what we got. Let me go ahead and give you guys some um, letters. This may resonate, you guys. Um, this could be either initials. This could be a name. For every 100 new subscribers, somebody will get a free read. Um, this is a Train to Go perk. Um, if this right here resonates at all and you are a member of Train to Go, please go ahead and contact me regarding this video. And I will put some energy on this for you. Um, for my verified subscribers, you guys, this you can, if you'd like, um, put your situation down there and um, I will pull randomly. OK, uh, for you guys. Join train to go. It is about being a no. We are clicked up. We got a whole lot of wonderful people there. Um, I did not put a Miss Friday up this week. I will be putting a Miss, Miss Friday up next week, you guys. Um, but I, I celebrate them all the time. It's just my it, Mercury retrograde and the way things are, uh, devices are tripping. It was just really hard for me to do the upload, but, um, there will be, um, there is a Miss Friday this Friday, but I will be putting her up tomorrow. 
I mean, excuse me, next Friday. Um, but yeah, join Train to Go, you guys. A lot of perks going on here, okay? One of the promos is you get a free read, okay? Depending upon what tier you're on. Um, uh, one of the promos is easier access to me. Another one of the promos is, um, you know, uh, one free question a week or two free questions a week, depending upon what tier you're on. Okay. Um, right. Let me, um, get you guys some, uh, time frames. So yeah, for every 100 new subscribers, somebody will get a free read. My um, mystery graphs are very fun. They're very random. And also my uh, monthly winners, okay? You guys, as you know, I celebrate my monthly winners. I celebrate everybody, y'all. Um, You do have to be a verified subscriber to be able to take part in any one of my plans, my giveaways, or my grabs. The numbers 1 through 15 just popped out at me. If you guys are interested in a read, please go in the comment. Excuse me. Please go in the description box. You guys want to draw all the way down because I got a whole lot of stuff in that description box. Go in, the, <clears throat> go in the description, guys. You guys will see my prices. You guys will see the details of my plans and you will see my email. Please do not hesitate to email me. I love to hear from you guys, okay? Um, if you guys are going through a spiritual journey, please check my book out. It's behind me, you guys. It's called Train to Ascend. You can find it on Amazon. If you guys are going through any type of karmic relationship, heartbreak, having a hard time letting love go, please visit my website, hrhnikkitarot.com. Hopefully that um, can help you, the things that I've wrote there. And I will be, I've been saying that for the longest, but you guys, I got so much other stuff. I got the cards I'm doing and I'm still doing the book. Y'all, I got some stuff, but I will be getting to the, um, to the, the website, okay? Um, and you guys can sign up to that website. That website is free. It costs you absolutely nothing. It never will. I'm the one that pays for that website every month. Okay. Just so that it's my way of giving back. You guys, I love you guys dearly. Okay. So I really hope that if those articles do help you. Okay. Um, and it's also private. Nobody can see that you've, you've been on there. If you sign up for the newsletter, I'm the only person that can see that you've, um, been on there. Okay. Um, so anyway, you guys, uh, uh, one through 15 is the numbers that I have here, November, May, March, that may be, uh, um, relevant, may not be relevant. I, I don't know. November, May, March, springtime and summertime that may be relevant as well. So we got springtime, summertime, we got November, we got May, we got March and we got the numbers one through 15. All right, you guys, we got two letter O's. We got two letter N's. We got the letter J. We got the letter D. We got the letter P. We got the letter D. We got the letter S. We got the letter Z. X, V, K, W, F, T, R, and L. Okay? So let me go ahead and run that back. So you got L, R, T, F, W, K, V, X, Z, S, D, P, two D's, y'all, two D's. J, two N's, and two O's, okay? And L, and R, okay? So let me tell you guys who's on the table. This person wants to be a knight of wands, you guys, right? This is a dude with a female, okay? They want to be adventurous. They want to be in and out. They want to be flirtatious, okay? They want to be out here like this, okay? They want to do that. Somebody is definitely in some type of legal problems. There will be some type of cutoff here. Aquarius is prevalent. Pisces is here. Somebody is weak, okay, to this. Um, there may be an intervention going on, something with family, maybe lump sum money, something like that. Somebody is lost here, you guys. They've lost their way, all right? That's going to be the truth for some of you. Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Libra. Aries, Taurus. Um, Leo, Aquarius, Scorpio, and Taurus, Capricorn, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries, Scorpio, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, Sagittarius, somebody is at a distance or somebody has to travel. Travel may be what they might do, okay? This person is a skilled manipulator. This person is a skilled liar. Be ready for some compensation. I don't know how well it's going to go, okay? Virgo is here. Taurus is here. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Sagittarius. 
somebody is definitely negotiating with themselves on how to make this work. They're coming to an awakening, okay, that this relationship is a tragedy. Time is ticking, you guys. Time is ticking regarding this commitment, okay? So this is what I do have for you. Hopefully, I was able to put one piece together for you. If I was, that means I definitely done my job. I'd appreciate it if you like, share, and subscribe. And always remember, cross-watch your energy can and will get involved in this. I love you guys, and I'll see you guys soon.